Hey folks, how's it going? So our warm up today is two parts. So the first part is three rounds of 30 seconds of work for each movement. So you've got jumping jacks, all right? You want to get fancy, you can do seal jacks, okay? Uh, and then we're into body weight only squats, all right? So we're just trying to warm up here so you don't have to really hammer those out. Maybe the second or third round you can. Then we've got some high knees, so right in place. High knees, 30 seconds of that, and then you'll rest for a minute. So do that three times. Once that's done, you have two rounds. You're going to do six bottoms up presses right here. Can't really see me. Six bottom up presses. Make sure your head's through at the top. Then you're going to do six, sorry, you're going to do six tricep extensions. So kettlebell behind your head right here. All right, again, it doesn't have to be super heavy. So if your kettlebell's too heavy, grab a water jug, grab a dumbbell, grab a book, something like that, okay? And then you're going to do 10 single leg deadlifts per side, no kettlebell. So let's focus on movement here. Staying nice and square to the floor. Get as low as you can. Strong in that back leg, all right? 10 per side there, and then as always, 10 swings, okay? So you have two rounds of that. Once that's done, we've got four rounds. You'll need a timer or something for this as well. So you're gonna start with 30 swings. 30 swings. Now look, if you wanna break it up, you wanna do two hand swings, single hand swings, whatever, you gotta get 30. Once those 30 are done, pick an arm, overhead carry for 30 seconds, okay? walking around your room, wherever you're doing this. Okay, cool. Then you're into 30 sit-ups, or if you want, leg raises. Okay, 30 of those. You gotta bang those out quick, quick, quick. Then you're doing your overhead carry on the other arm, walk around 30 seconds. Rest as needed, when needed, where needed. You've got four rounds of that. So that's a lot of swings, a lot of sit-ups, okay? Make sure your form is perfect. And then finally, we've got a little core finisher. So it's two rounds, but it's a little, there's a little twist here. You're doing 15 seconds of work, 15 seconds of rest, four times. It's only one movement, okay? So set your timer for 15 and 15 for essentially four circuits or four cycles or four rounds of that. So we're doing hollow holds. Whatever your hollow hold is, you're gonna hold it for 15 seconds. You want to rock, go nuts. You have 15 seconds on, 15 seconds off. That would be one little cycle. After my 15 seconds rest, there's my second, third, fourth. You do that four times, take one minute rest, and then do it one more time, okay? So essentially you're doing eight cycles of that. Enjoy. 